The city of Clinton held a news conference this morning announcing the reinstatement of Anthony Fox to the Clinton Police Department. 12 News' Tia McKenzie, she's live from the Clinton Municipal Court with some details. Tia. Tao, after a grueling 551 days in prison, Anthony Fox is now a free man. The city of Clinton expressed their support to him and his family today. Mayor Phil Fisher of Clinton expressed his gratitude to the state court of appeals after the reversal of Fox's conviction in the 2019 death of George Robinson. Fisher says he's thankful to have Fox back on the Clinton police force. Fox was a Jackson police officer at the time of the 2019 incident, but was hired by Clinton police sometime after. In 2022, a Hines County jury found him guilty of culpable negligence manslaughter, but the Court of Appeals found that evidence in the case was insufficient, reversing that decision. Now Fox will return to work with Clinton police as a K-9 narcotics detective. Mayor Fisher took jabs at Hines County judicial system during today's news conference. The Court of Appeals decision to overturn was based on mistakes made by Judge Wooten and the insufficient evidence presented by the Hines County District Attorney, Jody Owens. I am grateful to the Court of Appeals that they had the courage to right this wrong. Although this nightmare for De Detective Fox is over, one must wonder after watching this unfold if anyone can receive justice from a Hines County judge elected to be fair and impartial. 12 News has reached out to Judge Adrian Wooten for comment. We're waiting to hear back. And today is Fox's first day back on the job in Clinton. Live from the Clinton Municipal Courts, Tia McKenzie, 12 News.